Update 8.2 has just arrived, and we've got plenty for you, including a new crate weapon, new throwable, cosmetic updates for a couple of weapons, and more. Let's dive in. First up, there's a new machine gun in town, spawning exclusively in care packages. The MG3 is a 75-round LMG that uses 7.62 ammunition, and can be set to fire at two different speeds. Take down your enemies with a bit more control at 660 RPM, or show them the true meaning of bullet hell by switching to the weapon's 990 RPM setting. In addition, every fifth round and the last ten rounds of your magazine will be tracer shots, giving you a bit more visual information on where your shots are headed. The MG3 also does increased damage to vehicles and features a bipod for significantly increased control while prone. For now, you can only find the MG3 in normal matches, but we'll keep you updated when we plan to introduce them into rank mode. Up next is a new way to distract and disorient your opponents. The decoy grenade is a new throwable that mimics gunfire sounds for 10 seconds. The deceptive decoy can be used in a variety of ways, including flushing enemies out of cover, covering your advance, or getting enemies to turn away before you begin your spray. The decoy grenade spawns as rare world loot, exclusively on Sanak, and will only be in normal games for the time being. The Car 98 k SKS, and M416 have all received a cosmetic update this patch. All three weapons have been remodeled from scratch for higher visual fidelity, along with a sound quality improvement to match. We've updated helmet slots to allow you to choose what you see while playing. By toggling your helmet off, you'll keep your cosmetic hat or hoodie visible but be aware that this toggle is only visible to you. Enemies and teammates will still see you wearing your helmet. Players feeling a little nostalgic can now swap out their lobby music to one of several different options from over the years. You'll be reset back to the default music each new season, but you can feel free to switch it up whenever you like. For players who have been eager to battle it out against a group of friends, we've added Team Deathmatch to custom game settings. Grab some friends or members of your community and see who comes out on top. One last thing. The eSports menu has been updated with the PCS2 Pickup Challenge. Like before, you can participate in the fun by making your own predictions for the chance to win some great PCS2 skins. Check out our patch notes for the full schedule. That wraps up this patch report, but there's plenty more details on what Update 8.2 brings. You can check out our patch notes for everything new, or just jump in and play for yourself. We'll see you next time.